Hey family, what's good? This is your girl, I am the Bronze Goddess, and I'm actually here to do my May favorites video. I'm going to show you guys quite a few things that I have been loving for the month of May. There's quite a few makeup products, there's a, an article of clothing, there's an app, there's some food, uh, there's a little bit of everything, music, movies, you name it. Alright, so let's go to jump right into it. The first thing I'm going to show you guys is an app. I'm going to show you guys right here on my iPhone. If you have an iPhone 5 or better, this app is going to be perfect for you, especially if you take lots of photos and lots of pictures and videos and all of that. The app is called Vogue. Photo, which is kind of a mashup of video and photo and I'm going to show you guys how it works it's super super cute what it does is it takes your videos and turns them into photos so you can kind of capture the moment in more ways than one I'm gonna show you guys really quickly how it works by showing you guys one of the videos that I selected on my iPhone so I'm gonna actually select this video right here which is a video of my husband and my daughter I'm going to tell it to find the photos as you guys can see that it just breaks your breaks your video down into picture form. You guys can see this is super cute. This really captures the moment. This is my husband and my youngest daughter, my oldest daughter. Okay, so that's how it works. It's super easy and cute. It's perfect if you're going to a, a festival or a carnival, if you're going to a theme park. You know, a lot of times, you know, your things are moving so quickly, you barely have time to break them down and take a picture. So um, this is a great thing for you to do if you're interested in that type of thing, if you love taking videos and photos and all of that. Check me out on there if you do sign up. It's absolutely free. I'll leave my link to mine below if you guys want to see what videos I have posted on there. And yeah, now let's go ahead and get into the hair and makeup and all of that good stuff, all right? So for the hair, um, I know this isn't for my hair, but it works amazing on my daughter's hair, so I had to uh, put it in my favorites. And that is the Aphrodisia 9 Exotic Leave-In Hair Potion. This is from Entwine Couture. They actually sent me this bottle, and it was so amazing, and it worked so great on my daughter's hair that I actually got a second bottle. This is amazing for revitalizing their curls. They both have a different curl pattern. My youngest daughter, her curls are tighter, and this makes her curls pop. If you have natural hair and you're looking for something to kind of enhance and define your curls, kind of define them and make them look you know, really beautiful, this works amazing in both of their hair. So yeah, I do um, love this stuff. It's the Aphrodisia 9 from Entwine Couture. That's the only hair product that I want to talk about. But now I want to talk about makeup because I have quite a few makeup items to show you guys. If you watched my recent uh, makeup tutorial, you saw me use this right here. And this is the LA Girl Pro Concealer High Definition Concealer. This is in the color Espresso. This is what I have on my face today. I'm not even using foundation these days. I just use this concealer with a little bit of my Ben Nye um, Translucent Face Powder in Topaz and that's it. My color that I use is Espresso. It works amazing. It doesn't crease. It doesn't move you set it and forget it okay so I'm loving this concealer amazing quality product for like a dollar ninety nine or something I've also been using this sometimes and I'm I'm really getting on the face primer bandwagon I didn't think I needed one I didn't see what the big deal was but I did get a sample and this really has turned you know has changed my mind about how I feel about face concealers this is a Smashbox photo ready foundation primer I use a little bit of this sometimes and when I do you guys always make comments about how good my how good how good honey how good how good my skin looks and so you I always can tell you guys can always tell because you always be like oh what are you using in your skin you're glowing that's when Whenever I use this Smashbox face uh, primer, I'm gonna actually get a bigger port, a bigger size of this. This is kind of a trial size, but I really, really love this primer. It's amazing. It mattifies. It fills in all the pores, any fine lines, anything like that. This works amazing. It gives your foundation or concealer or whatever a very smooth canvas to build on, and it's just amazing. It gives you the appearance of a beautiful, flawless face. Love this stuff. As far as eyeshadows, I've been rocking this eyeshadow right here, which is by Cargo Cosmetics. This is in uh, Aegean or Aegean, or the Aegean Sea. And I actually I wore this eyeshadow in a recent video, and you guys were commenting on how well my eyeshadow looked. This was the color that I had on my lid. It's by Cargo Cosmetics. I actually got it in my April We Are Onyx box. Love, love, love this. So pigmented. A beautiful, high-quality um, eyeshadow. And for my face, I have been rocking this blush. This is actually the first MAC blush I think I ever bought. And this is in Ambering Rose. It's actually this kind of coppery color. I either I go between this and my Cargo Cosmetics Laguna blush whenever I want like an orangey one. But this is more like a 
bronzy, orangey color, coppery um, color. And I love you doing this blush whenever I'm doing kind of gold eye and a nude lip. Just really kind of going for that no makeup makeup look. Please tell me below if you guys want me to make a video like that, a no makeup makeup look. But I'm loving this blush. I don't. It's kind of a rediscovery. I've had it forever. Put it down. It was in the back of my makeup drawer. I finally was like, let me see what's up with you. And I love it. Ambering Rose, Ambering Rose by Mac. And for lipsticks, two lipsticks that I have absolutely been loving. The first one I am wearing right now, and the name, ah, uh, the name suits it. This is Mac. Flat out fabulous. It is a retro matte. It is a beautiful, in your face, beautiful pink color. It looks great with yellow, like the yellow dress that I'm wearing today. Love, love, love lips, this lipstick right here. It's actually, I thought nothing could ever take the place of Ruby Woo, but this is right there. This is right up underneath my Ruby Woo, and that is saying a lot, okay? And this lipstick right here, I would have never in a million years thought this lipstick would be in a favorites video, but this is Max Snob, and it's actually kind of a nudie pink color. When I first got it, I thought I was going to look like um, Tyrone Bigsby or Ashy Larry because it, it looked kind of chalky. But now that I've kind of figured out how to work with it, I just use a really dark uh, brown lip liner and then I kind of fill it in and I just add a little tiny bit of this just to add a little bit of color to my lips and then I go over it with a nice pinky um, lip gloss. But I have figured out how to work this and now I'm actually loving it, believe it or not, okay? Thank you guys for telling me not to return it. So I'm loving Snob from MAC as well. Now, this right here, if you saw my recent Love With Food unboxing, I was excited about these cookies. These were the um, key lime pie cookies that I saw in my um, uh, Love With Food box, and I was excited about trying them. So anyway, when I turned the camera off, I decided to try all the treats, and I tried this, and I loved it. When I ate the last cookie, I went right on their website and bought a whole box. I bought a whole box of these cookies. If you love key lime pie, you're gonna love these cookies. They taste like little key lime pies. They're so, so, so good. And uh, oh, one more makeup favorite that I forgot to show you guys before I got to my food. But um, that's these. These are from Shani Cosmetics. These are their gel eyeliners. I've been using these to add pops of color in my tear duct, if you guys have been seeing that lately. I've been using it in my waterline. These are amazing pops of color. I've been especially loving this blue right here. Look how vibrant that is. Like a gorgeous blue. I've been loving the purple, the turquoise. I love using these as eyeshadow bases and, and also using them as gel liners for pops of color whenever I'm doing a neutral eye lip, uh, eye look. I'm kind of doing a lot of the look that you see today. Bold lips, neutral eye, and maybe like a pop of color in my tear duct or in my waterline. And these little gel eyeliners are perfect for that. And now another quick food product that I don't have with me, but for those of you that don't know, Cheesecake Factory actually sells the most banging, banging crab cake sandwiches. And they don't even put them on the menu. So whenever my husband and I go there, we order them anyway, and they always make them for us. They are so good. The secret to a good crab cake is not a whole lot of fillers. They don't use imitation crab, they don't use a whole bunch of breadcrumbs, none of that stuff. It is just the most decadent, rich, Crab cake. It is so doggone good. If you go to Cheesecake Factory and you don't know what to get, get that and get yourself an Oreo cheesecake to go with it. Girl, forget about it, all right? Now, um, the last couple of things I want to show you guys is this thing right here. I have been loving for the month of May kimonos. I have like three right now, but this one right here is my favorite. I actually did an outfit of the day featuring this one. This one's from She Inside. I absolutely love it. Look at that. Detail on the back, so authentic looking. I love this particular kimono because it goes great with white, white cutoff shorts, white skinny jeans, a white um, little mini dress underneath, or you could wear it with some jeans, some um, just dark blue, light blue, any kind of skinny jeans or whatever. These are so, this is so adorable and I just love it. I love it, love it. This is from, like I said, from She Inside. And the last couple of things um, is a movie. Uh, well, two movies actually. The first one is The Peoples, and that one has Kerry Washington in a Craig, Craig Johnson, I think his name is, if I'm not mistaken, David Allen Greer. And it's a really, really funny movie. I don't know why it didn't do well in the theater, but it was so funny. We got it on, we watched it on Netflix for free, okay? Awesome movie, so funny. You will get your laugh on. And uh, yeah, check that movie out if you haven't. And also, Frozen. 
When the movie first came out, I took my daughters with my husband and it was a great movie. I cried, you know, my daughter was looking shook. She was in the theater. <laughs> that is an amazing, amazing movie. Now the movie, uh, came out on DVD and it's like $5.99 to rent. My daughter has us renting that movie. I don't know why we didn't just buy it. But anyway, it's amazing and she loves the song from there. Here's a little quick clip of her singing the song, singing her heart out, singing one of the lead song from there. She absolutely loves, loves, loves that movie. If you have any daughters or if you just want a good, feel good movie, you have to check it out. It's Frozen. Love that movie. Favorite cartoon for me of all time. All right? So anyway, that is it. Hope you guys enjoyed this favorites video. I will leave the link to the app. You guys can check me out if you want to, to Voto. I will leave it below in the description box. Check me out. See what I got on there. And sign up. It's free. But anyway, I love you guys. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Till next time. Later, Davis and Dudes. Deuces, honey.